It was a heartbreaking moment as an hour day broke into tears when she was reminded of her late son who served for the Islamic Medical Association of Uganda. Being a member of the association, Hajat al Salwega thanked all those who have helped the association in lifting its flag higher. Because I thought if I put myself in working for the Muslim, for Islam, it will keep me even if I left this world. But unfortunately, it didn't continue. But I dedicate my award to him, Yasan Gawesan. The President, Islamic Medical Association of Uganda, Professor Majid Kajimu, says they are to continue awarding its members in order to encourage young doctors to do the same. Uh, this um, uh, ceremony is, in, uh, is one of our um, ways of trying to educate our, our people to serve the Islamic Medical Association of Uganda, uh, which starts with serving Allah, serving our association, serving our communities, and serving our people, all people in Uganda, in the health sector. Professor Kajimo says there is need to embrace the faith-based approach for continuous quality improvement in patient care for Muslim doctors. main criteria is loyalty. Those who have been loyal, loyal to the organization, whether they are, you know, challenges, organizations go through challenges, and you go ups and downs, but those who have been consistently loyal. Some of the awardees attributed their success to the dedication they show while on duty. Being appreciated for the service that have been done for the community, both as Muslim and a co worker, right from the beginning when I began, they began serving in Uganda as an intern doctor in 1992, uh, 82 I mean, up to now. The awardees include Dr. Yusuf Walakira, Hajat Safina Kisu Musene, Dr. Vali Jusa Sadik Jaffa, and Hajat Aligawesa Ajiri Rubega, among others, Sudat Kaye, UBC.